how do you use your resources in a way that it empowers your experience? How do you run a machine in a way that it, expower, it empowers and it fuels the machine to go to somewhere? This has been my experience with experiencing and practicing with my rage. And with my rage, I tapped into an inner resource that really cuts through the bullshit and it cuts through anything that's around me and it really has this power to pierce and like bring life into my space and bring clarity through raising that vibration of my clarity, my wanting, what I want, my yes and my no. In this space, we're gonna be exploring about how you can tap into those resources inside of yourself so that you can see them, feel them, experience them, and share them with others in a team. Share this rage in a team. Hear yourself, what do I sound like? How do I sound like when I'm using my anger? What is my anger like? What does it sound like? And this is the space to explore that. This is the space to bring yourself to your body and through your anger, through your work with anger, get to feel all the rest of your feelings and not being running away from them and backing, backing away from your commitments and escaping into fantasy worlds. You need your anger to create the things that you want to create in the world. You need your anger and your strength, your, your intensity. It is there. I'm not creating it. It is already there. This is something that I've been carrying inside of myself and I've been using it in ways that have been unconscious. For example, I use it in a way to internalize it and, and in a way to punish myself. And in this is ways that are normal for society to use our anger. It's okay to use your anger to punish yourself. It's okay to use it to persecute others or to punish others for doing things that are wrong. And this is a new experience of what I've been learning to use with my anger, that it has the power to fuel my clarity and what I want to say, what I want to create, to hold the space, to create a space for aliveness to come through. And your rage in your anger, it has that capacity, it's your initial, it's your spark, it's your fire that has that warrior quality to it that allows you to feel your other feelings. It allows you to be in your fear and you have your anger right there. It's your warrior, your protector, it's your guardian. And in this space of the sounds of rage, we're going to be exploring that and you're going to be experiencing that from within yourself through some practices and some distinctions that and experiments that we're gonna be doing in this space. So I look forward to seeing you there and I look forward to working with you in seeing your rage and seeing your aliveness and bringing this forward for your gift and your purpose to manifest into the world. Thank you.